Hey guys, this is the last vlog from our Detroit, Chicago step in trip. Atlanta. Oh, welcome. Yeah, thank you. Oh, that warm weather. They told me. We're going to be gone. <laughs> I love your look, though. You're welcome. Thank you. That's the outfit of the day. I love your theme. But I love the shirt. I love the hair, the new style. I love the earrings. I love the glasses. I love the the sun on the front of your shirt. I love what you did with your hair. Actually, it's just tactics. What? I intentionally brought the glasses and the earrings. Yes. The rest of it just came just to keep. play this morning. Thank you. Your suitcase was just amazing. Guys, I think I'm going to film her suitcase when we get back so you all can see just how organized Stephanie was and I have is. 15 outfits in my suitcase. <laughs> yes. She made sure that I had at least two outfits for each day that we were Okay. Two okay. And then. Not necessarily choices, two outfits. outfits. One for the day and one for the evening. And I have the other four just in case I wanted to switch something out. And then you have stepping outfits and walking outfits. Yes. And shoes to match the outfits. How big was your luggage? Just a regular size, large luggage. That's it. That's amazing. You, you say it lightly, but that's amazing. A lot of people cannot organize and pack that way. Punto. Period. They can't. But I thought I did a pretty good job. But when I looked over in yours, <laughs> I was like, okay, you didn't, Claudia. You can learn. We can all do what? Learn. <laughs> These pics came from the white party. So you see my sister and her friends were ready. And of course, I was in white and I enjoyed the pics and watching the dancing.
Once we got home to our Detroit Airbnb, we stopped by Coney Island Restaurant again and had our second amazing, infamous Coney Island meal. Ah, oh, was it ever good. guys welcome back to the channel it's your girl Claudia I am back from the Detroit Chicago stepping trip that I shared with my sister and her two friends so I really enjoy watching my sister and her friends do that dance now while I'm watching them do that dance in Detroit for a week I thought hmm I might want to do this dance one day. I mean, I've been following my sister for so long, and I used to follow my other sister. Whenever they went to Chicago stepping sets in the city here, I would go with them and see them dance and enjoy being uh, spun around by the guys. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's the beat that they do to that. So I'm like, oh, one day I think I might have to learn how to do that. But I am really feeling the proclivity to do the ballroom stepping. The, or I don't even know if you call ballroom stepping. The ballroom dancing. I am going to start with ballroom. So that is so exciting to me. Plus, I'm going to learn how to do the salsa. And I saw several female dancers, beautiful, beautiful, dance the Chicago Stepping dance with a blend of what they knew of ballroom and salsa and just blended it. And it was just a dramatic, sensual production when you saw them. And some of them you will see in the vlogs that I posted already with that trip. So go and look at that. Don't, you don't want to miss that. But it, so you guys have a great day. I'll see you again in another vlog. Love you, love you. And be happy. Don't worry. Be happy. This is one of the little dresses that I styled while in Detroit. Oh, oh. I'm going to do some vlogs on ballroom dancing when I start learning how to do that. So I'll take you with me on that and some of the other dancing. Kazumba. My friend uh, does Kazumba dancing. She was telling me all about it recently. Plus she had been telling me about that dance years ago. But you know, you, you just never are ready for something until you're ready. So now I'm ready to live and do that dance as well as I do my thing in my professional life, in my family life. Bring it all together with a little more fun. Okay, guys. See you in another vlog. Bye.